Look at those little feet. Do you know whose feet those belong to? Oh my goodness. They are so cute. Need to spend more time looking at the baby's feet because they're adorable. And the baby's wearing a vintage gown. It's one of the drawstring gowns. Oh my goodness, it's Ocean! And he is dressed in a gender neutral gown. He's got blue and pink with him because we're doing a gender reveal for my next baby. We even have a confetti balloon, which I'm sure I'm going to regret doing that after the best is made, but it will be fun. So that's exciting. Um, yeah, we're going to do a gender reveal because like with every baby, I always set out with a particular gender in mind and sometimes it changes or sometimes I stay the same with the gender I want for the doll. And I thought that we could do a gender reveal because you guys don't know if I've changed my mind on the gender for the baby that I'm making for myself. So how exciting is this? Is it going to be blue or pink? Head, what do you think it's going to be? Well, that's not Head. That's Heather, but she's named after Head. <laughs> what do you think is going to be? Blue or pink? I did, I did, I did, I did. So, yeah, I thought this is my first time decorating for a gender reveal. I've never done this before and um, thought it would be fun. They didn't have this taking place when Tambry was a baby, so <laughs> there was no gender reveal. And... Before we get started, happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. And happy Mother's Day to those people who stand in the position of a mother, whether you're male or female. Happy Mother's Day to you as well because there are parents like myself who for the first seven years I was mom and dad. So I know what it's like for Father's Day to come around and be like, well, hey, you know, I should still get credit because... I am the father, technically. I'm doing everything as a father would, and I'm doing what a mother would do as well. So I understand that other people stand in the role of being a mother or a father. So happy Mother's Day to everybody who is a mother to someone, and even to your dogs or your cats. Happy Mother's Day to you as well. Okay, so what is your guess on, boy or girl? I'm not going to give my guess because I don't want to give it away as to what I officially decided on the gender for my baby doll. Um, so you guys can guess. Go ahead and comment. Boy, girl, boy, girl. I want a girl in my collection, but things don't always go that way. Um, for some reason, whatever gender I want, it typically ends up being the opposite gender. So, yeah. So I'm excited, a little nervous because I don't know if this is going to be too loud. But let's see, are we ready? Are we ready to see what we're getting, a boy or a girl? Here we go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Whoa, that made a bigger mess than I expected. Oh my goodness. We got a girl, guys. Yay, how exciting. Oh my gosh. <laughs> now that we know I'm having a girl, I have some things to show you guys that you've not seen before. So we found this hat at a secondhand store. It says girl. It's like embroidered somehow. It's really cute. Super cute. I love it. It looks vintage. I don't know if it is vintage, but it looks vintage. But I like it. And then we found this vintage receiving blanket for her. So adorable. Um, it's white flannel with like it looks like sprinkles all over it and then in block letters It says baby and then there's a pink bear sitting on top of the block and it's trimmed with pink fabric So super cute. I really really love these two items a lot I think they're adorable Then I had a ten dollars off at Carter's so I paid two dollars and some change for this outfit it's um, kind of like rainbow style, but more pastel. Really cute onesie. And then it has 
the salmon color pink shorts that are trimmed in a lighter pink, which are the same stripe, the same stripe as pink on this on the onesie. So that is a really cute outfit. And then I found a vintage Carter's outfit for her. So adorable. Well, Jackie found it, but um, we were shopping at one of the local thrift stores and it's the diaper cover. So cute. It's sea life. It's got different fishes, even a little seabird there and a turtle. And it is very cute. This is the kind of tag it has for Carter's. And then it has a top. Super cute. And then I thought I would match it with um, this headband because there's peach and some of these uh, animals on here with the little socks. So she'll be wearing um, this top with the bloomers and then a headband and socks. I think it's gonna look super cute on her. I think both of these outfits will look adorable. They would even look really cute on Ocean, but no Ocean, these are for your sister. I'm trying to keep that. But yeah, did, you, has, did anybody have this for their baby, their real baby? If so, what year is it? I'd love to know what year it is. I'm thinking the 90s. Ocean did get something very cute. I love this outfit. It says handsome for sure. And it's a yellow onesie with a blue ocean. And there's a big O shark. And then the sun setting and a little sailboat. And I love the pants. There's like a burnt orange color. And then there's sharks going through it. And they are a brown color. So I thought that would look really cute on ocean so he got that outfit now we had to get this outfit it is so freaking cute um we didn't really have a baby for this size of the outfit but we loved it well jackie really really loved it it's by spumoni in san francisco really cute outfit i don't know what size it is actually it looks like it is 18 months it's 18 months so we thought that this would fit um, Cricket. I wanted to call her Betty for some reason right now. So we thought that we could put it on Cricket, although it looks like it might be a little big for her. But anyways, we just really picked it up because it, it's so cute. We just could not leave it behind. We've never seen anything like this outfit. And it is adorable. Kind of gives me like 80s, 90s vibes. Has anyone seen this outfit, this brand? Super cute. So yeah, so... We may just put it away for a toddler because now looking at Cricket, I think it's going to be way too big for Cricket. Too big for Chrissy, too. I don't know. We'll see. It's going to get worn one day around here. Or it could end up on the website. Who knows? But for now, we're definitely keeping it. We think it is so adorable. So we'll... I need a toddler in my collection. But it's super cute. Yeah, I think it might be a little big for Cricket. I don't know. No, I think you're right. Yeah, but it, it's so cute, though. So, yeah, maybe we'll just hang it on the wall so we can look at it because it's so adorable. Yeah. Angel, you don't need to bark right like there. that. I know. Just put it right here. Yeah, Actually, I think we're just going to hang it on the wall until we get a baby this size. And I need a toddler in my collection, so it's time to start looking at the toddler kits. Can dream. That would be a long time for a toddler now. Um, but yeah, so cute. So we're just going to put it on the wall. It'll be an adorable piece to go there. It's just, it's so cute. I mean, have you seen an outfit like this before? I have not. It's very unique. So much detail into it. Children's clothes is just, they don't make it like this anymore. There we go. Look at that. That is adorable. Perfect place for that outfit to be. It is so cute. It's just another decorative piece on the wall absolutely love it do have one more outfit it's 12 months size but i think i'm gonna have it be worn on ocean it'll just be a little big but it'll look cute once it's on him a little romper so this is really cute it's velour filling it is so nice and it's like a copper color and it's by the the romp around collection 12 month size. Look at the snaps. I love the snaps. And then I, you know, I have this blanket here that I was showing you guys. And the blanket kind of coordinates with the outfit. So I thought that would be so cute. So I'm going to be putting this on him soon, actually. You know, maybe we'll put it on him in this video because it is just so cute. I want to see it on him.
All right, is missing just one little button right there, but that's okay. There he is. Oh my goodness. He looks so cute in that outfit. And then his little blanket matches. Oh my gosh. The outfit is so soft. It's adorable. Really, really like it a lot. So I thought the outfit was missing a button and it's not. That's just how it's designed. Three buttons in the middle and then it stays open on the sides. It's very interesting. But he's still so adorable in it. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. It was a blast to make this video for you guys. I hope you're having a wonderful day, staying safe, not giving into those negative energies you may be dealing with. Just block whatever negativity it is and move on. Remember that they're not the ones relevant. You are and your happiness matters. All right, guys, we'll be back soon. Bye.